And now it's time for the moment of silence. Will you all please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance? already awesome combine it with that sticky and sweet caramel and it's just next level snacking so go ahead and treat yourself today but now it's time for Twain TV I'm Natalia he is Roger and I'm Angela today is Friday April 6 2018 a fourth period return day now it's time for the latest news from the studio all students attending the Hayfield rising ninth grade trip should report to the cafeteria at 9 a.m. You should have a pass to show your second period teacher. So put everything in your locker, aside from a coat or a jacket if you want one. If you have a signed permission form that isn't turned in, then bring it to the cafeteria at 9 a.m. Got it? News crew will take its yearbook photo today right after 6th period. Here is the plan. After 6th period, get your stuff from your locker quickly, then go to the lecture hall. The quicker everyone is able to get here, the faster it will go. Don't worry about the buses, as they will wait for you, we promise. All 7th and 8th grade members should report. Now it's time for the birthdays. Happy birthday to Adrian, Ryan, and Alexander. We hope you have a fantastic day. Happy early birthday to Mitchell and Eliana. Now it's time for the lunch menu. Hamburger, cheeseburger, spicy chicken on bun, spicy chicken wrap, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches or beef soft taco. Choice of two vegetables, baby carrots, smiley potatoes or steamed green beans. Choice of one fruit, orange slices or chilled pineapple. The Student Services College Madness ends today with the champion. The Villanova Wildcats won March Madness with a dominant performance. The Wildcats are from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Did you know that the cost to attend Villanova was $125.1843, but $68,000 in 2018? At least that includes room and board, though. A big thanks to Student Services and the AVID team for providing College Madness this year. But reading is a spot hot sport here at Twain. You're going to want to be on this leaderboard. Every time you read a book, simply use the link or a QR code found on these flyers around the school to fill out a Google form. And if Roger can do it, so can you. There will be a pizza party and some secret prizes for you to win. Get reading. Library finds got you down. Head to the library during lunch to read off your fines. Each lunch period is reading uh, worth $2.50 of fines. Just get a pass ahead of time or see Miss Godfrey or Miss Shaken for details. Today is the last day to get your shirt orders in at custominc.com slash twain slash fundraising slash twain 4h 2018. That's customing.com slash fundraising slash Twain 4H 2018. See, it's there. For $15, you can get the t-shirt. And for just $25, you can get the hoodie. All proceeds benefit Twain's 4H club and our chickens to get your shirts. 
That's it from Twain TV. I'm Natalia. He is Roger. And I'm Angela. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook at Twain TV. And if you missed any part of Twain TV or want to see it again, subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Twain MS News. Also, check out the Twain TV podcast, available in nearly anywhere you get podcasts. Have, Have a, a frivolous, frivolous Friday, Friday, Twain! <laughs> Good morning, Mark Twain. Here's today's daily joke. What did the monster eat after the dentist pulled his tooth? The dentist. <laughs> Have a great day, Twain. Good morning, Mark Twain Middle School. Happy Friday, everyone. Just have a few announcements today. First one is about an event that took place yesterday. We were fortunate enough to have a Holocaust survivor come in and talk about his experience um, during the Holocaust. So every student that's associated with that, thank you very much for making that a special event, asking really good questions, being very good listeners, and certainly thank you to all the teachers that made that event possible. Um, today we have uh, an event for our rising ninth grade students that are going to Hayfield. Um, passes uh, have been given out and continue to be given out. So if you receive a pass, um, please make your way down to the cafeteria at 9 o'clock. You will not need any materials uh, for this trip, so please make sure you visit your locker. But then report promptly down to the cafeteria. If you have not yet turned in your permission form, make sure you bring that with you. Um, the next announcement is about Monday. Monday is a Friday schedule because next Friday is the end of the third quarter, which is a two-hour early release. So um, make sure that you're doing your homework this weekend and preparing for a Friday schedule on Monday. That is all. Have an excellent Friday, Twain.